Fisher, I just got a request from Francis Cohen. What does she need? She's been trying to get a man inside the bathhouse for a long time to keep tabs on the Red Nition. She wants to know if you can tap the phone lines in and around the building. Francis? Of course I can. Yeah. Good work, Fisher. That's the first phone line. See if you can tap into the rest. Something just go past him. Sam. You'll have some civilians in the bathhouse. Do not, I repeat, do not kill any of them. I'll be careful. Be more than careful. Be Gandhi. Yes, sir. Central, this is 7. Finish the basement. All clear. Yeah, okay. 7 out. don't look Japanese to me. Yeah, expensive suits cut wide in the shoulders. They're packing for sure. Exactly. I make them for displays, trying to keep a low profile. Makes sense. Doug knows how to stay discreet when it's necessary. Fisher, in order to figure out who Shetland is meeting with, You'll need to head up into the private offices. Check upstairs to the north of your position and past reception. On my way. Switch that off! The upstairs secure. Yeah, might be some Red Nation guys up in the private rooms, but I didn't disturb them. How about the? It's tight. A truck is blocking the alley, and I sent the guys unloading it for a coffee break. Which guys? Just some guys, worker guys. What? You just said, hey, why don't you guys take a break, and they did? Well, I gave them a hundred thousand yen. Oh, okay. Well, don't forget to expense that. Yeah, no kidding. That noise coming from.
this old jock lifted a tap in for par and now he has to wait in the clubhouse to watch the rest of the tournament on TV just like that. Got it. Shetland's meeting in the private baths in the back of the bathhouse in a little while. Who's he meeting? Red Nishin from the looks of it. Cohen was right. The bathhouse owner is pretty high up in the Japanese mob. Fisher, those two aren't this place. They're ISDF assault troops. What is ISDF doing here? Maybe the Red Nishin has sold Shetland out to the ISDF. Eavesdrop on that meeting figure out what's going on before ISDF blows this up. How are we gonna stop them? I'll get on the horn with Admiral Otomo and make sure we're all on the same page. Typical. What's wrong now? Switch the lights on. Next. Way to go, Sam. Cohen says there's one more phone line she'd like you to tap. Something. 
Show yourself. Signs of disturbance. That's the last phone line, Fisher. Cohen sends her thanks. Tell her it was my pleasure. Damn it! Oh, what was that? Zachary! Yes, sir. I just double-checked the blueprints. Turns out there's a vent that comes out in the meeting room. ISDF makes me nervous. Make sure the vent is clear of any surveillance gear. Yes, sir. Be quick about it. The meeting will start soon. I'm on it.
Lambert, ISDF is in the building. Are they making their move? I haven't been able to contact Otomo. I don't know what's going on. Wait a minute. Yes, this will do just fine. I told you I'd taken care of everything. We're secure. Jesus, Lambert. SDF isn't here to take Shetland down. They're meeting with him. They're his partners. My God. Stay there. We need to hear the details before we go to the Joint Chiefs with this. You did not bring them? I am not going to follow you across Tokyo. Relax, Kaneda. I'll just download them and burn you with this. Ha! Huh. You take me for a fool. You are not stupid enough to download them over a public network. What are you up to? I said relax. You're right. I'm not that stupid. My men just finished setting up a shadow net. Completely secure wireless, discreet from the web. Now sit. You'll have your algorithms in about four minutes. Call it! Lambert. Let it go, Fisher. We know the truth. We'll pick up the pieces after the dust settles. David Kaneda, I've seen it before. You're defending your honor to cover up your lies. Should I check the account, or should we start shooting and see who walks out of here? Kaneda! That's the wall! No, 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 please. We can work this out. We're switching the fallback. The chopper's on its way. Good. Secure this area. No one comes through. Yes, sir. Fisher? Kill Shetland. I know. Good thinking, Fisher. Looks like Shetland is using Sir Casey's infinite recursion code to run genetic algorithms. What? Wow. DOD is going to love this. Looks like Shetland is those people all sworn to target location independent with the sub-objectives without ever knowing what the plan is. Exactly. Kind of a bizarre inverse of Nikolaj's last day. Pointless, Sam. You won't know what to do if you catch me. Why bother chasing? My God, Fisher! Shetland has rigged the place to blow. There are bombs hidden in the furnace room. You'll have to find them all and fast. This thing's ruined. Mason and Lambert have you wrapped around their fingers, Fisher. You're no more to them than any other weapon.
yourself the instrument of a policy you don't believe in, Sam. Walk away. It doesn't have to end like this, Sam. No, but it does have to end. On that we agree. We've been fighting their dirty little wars our entire lives, and where do we end up? Staring at each other down the barrels of our guns. Nothing has changed, Fisher. And it won't change by degrees. We have to tear it down and start over. It's the only way. Your own little chaos theory, throw the world into war and hope that what comes out the other side is better. It will be better, because this war will change things, Sam. Every other war has been about keeping things the same, but the status quo doesn't work anymore. America's sick, Sam. She's dying. The politicians, the bureaucrats, the whispered backroom deals, it's all life support for a sick old lady who was dead a long time ago. The only backroom deals that I've seen lately were made by you. You're a murderer and a war criminal. Those are the only names the state has for the revolutionary, Sam. You only become a hero after the war is over. You know the truth. The world is built from the bottom up, not the other way around. Honor, courage, fidelity. We don't inherit these things from the world, Sam. We build the world from them. I know you. You believe in these things more than any government. And I know that because of it, you wouldn't shoot an old friend. You're right, Doug. I wouldn't shoot an old friend.